Hey everybody, this is Dr. Ayo, your natural Zen Diva, coming to you live and direct with your health tip of the day. Alright, so I got this question about flaxseed oil. Is it safe to use it if you have breast cancer? And the reason that question was asked, it's a common question because flaxseed oil, you've been seeing it in the news, it's, it's getting great press about the wonderful effects um, that it has. So, but the reason behind that question is it is a natural plant-based estrogen. So, of course, you know, if you have a type of breast cancer, um, you know, is, is it safe? Because it's a, a form of estrogen. It is considered beneficial to the breast and to the prostate. We've got some studies that show that it enhances the activity of one um, cancer drug, anti-cancer drug called tamoxifen. It's full of healthy nutrients like omega-3 essential fatty acids, um, also lignans, lignans, and it's a great source of vitamin D, which we know that there's a lot of vitamin D deficiency um, popping up these days. So it is a great source of vitamin D and also fiber. And we know with the amount of fiber that it does have, you have to make sure you're drinking lots of water to prevent any type of bowel obstruction. You know, anytime you're taking high fiber and you're not drinking enough water, you're running a risk of compromising your, uh, your bowels. So fiber, high in fiber, so make sure you're drinking lots of water. There was one study in 2007 that showed menopausal women, um, they actually noticed fewer hot flashes after adding the seed to their diet. And there was another study in 2005 in the International Journal of International Journal of Cancer, <laughs> excuse me, that found that the flaxseed actually halted the growth of developing breast cancer cells, and so therefore it slowed down the spreading of the cancerous cells. Any cautions with this? Definitely, um, if you have, since it is a plant, if you're prone to plant allergies, then of course you would have to monitor yourself, you know, for a rash or anything like that while you're taking it. Other than that, it looks like it's pretty safe. Um, so, you know, you might maybe, you maybe, you may want to, because <laughs> I'm tongue tied today, you may want to contact your physician and see if this is a supplement that you could find beneficial. So, there it is. That's your health tip of the day. This is Dr. Aya, your natural Zen Diva, out.